driving. Go into his place in LA so he can tattoo and I can do makeup. We're gonna tag team. Sounds dirty. So I'm doing makeup for a lighting company, a mirror company, I think. So I thought I'd bring you guys with me because my vlogs have been kind of all over the place. I don't finish them lately. Um, I'm just doing some light hair as well. So yeah, let's go and see how it goes. I look like um, that Snapchat filter when they had the the guy, the trucker guy with the mustache and the hat and stuff. That's what I look like right now. Uh, so I just finished and I got to show you guys like a little bit, right? I tried. So it's this company called Vanity and let me just tell you it's such a genius product. It's um, a vanity, like a vanity little mirror with a light on it. And then in the stand it has a fan. Let me tell you, that is a genius idea because you guys have seen in my videos like when it gets in, when I'm in my room filming, especially it gets really hot and I can't have my fan on. The one that I have in my room because it's so loud and this fan is like lighter, like you can't hear it as much. So I did make up, they're doing like a little commercial for it that'll be on their website and whatnot. Um, like how to use I guess so yeah I did make up for that and super cool like they gifted us one and I was so excited I was like oh my god I need this so I was really excited to get one when I get home I'll set it up and I'll show you guys what it looks like because it's again it's like such a cool little idea um, and I guess like they're just starting with it so there's gonna be newer ones like a travel one and different colors which I think again is a really good idea um, so yeah, now I'm just gonna go home, I think. I'm gonna go home. Maybe I'll stop by my mom's work. I don't know. Ew, my car is so dusty. Don't get black interior in your car. It just like shows you how disgusting you are. Yeah. I just got home a bit ago. I stopped at my mom's work and I visited her. Look how shiny I am. Ooh. My makeup's been on since six this morning, so. It's now three. Um, I just, so I got home and there were two packages waiting for me. And uh, one of them was this t-shirt. It says, Frankie says relax. I ordered this late at night. It was like three in the morning when I ordered this and I completely forgot about it. So when I opened it, I was like, oh yeah, I forgot I got this, but I got a men's large. So it's extremely big and I kind of don't know what to do. Maybe I could wear it like as a shirt dress or something or tie it I don't know it's cute though right Frankie says relax you know kind of old school and I'm gonna open this pack well it's a check I'm gonna open this package this package is the spotlight targeted skin lightener alpha hydrox anti-wrinkle um, I heard about this online I was reading about it somewhere it was on actually Oprah many many years ago and um, I like re-came across it. So this has glycolic alpha hydroxy acid, 
vitamin E. It also has hydroquinone, which lightens dark spots, discoloration, sunspots over time. I've been anti-hydroquinone for a long time, but I just kind of recently gave up on being anti-hydroquinone because I'm so over it. So this lightens dark spots. I have melasma underneath my eyes, and I've mentioned it before. You can't ever see it in my videos because my camera, my camera has like a softening effect to it. And also the lighting in my room, it's just, it's not true to how I look, um, which I mean is nice and that's great. But I tell you guys all the time, I have darkness under my eyes and I really do. I have melasma right here. It was from birth control I took a long time ago. I don't take that one anymore. I don't remember the name of it. It was a long time ago. And it just, it showed up right here. So it really sucks. A lot of ladies will get, they call it a pregnancy mask or um, melasma or dark spots. <laughs> but a lot of ladies will get them when they're pregnant um, or if there's a change in hormones, which makes sense because the birth control I was taking. Uh, so it showed up right here, right here, and um, some ladies get it above their lip. Uh, one lady I did makeup on her, she had it on the whole side of her cheek. It felt so bad for her. Sometimes it goes away after you have your baby, but in my case, I wasn't pregnant, um, and mine has not gone away after years. And like I was saying, I'm, I've been anti-hydroquinone forever because it's... It's been linked to cancer and it's banned in a lot of different countries, but they sell it over the counter, no problem, here in the States. Um, ooh, FedEx chase just came. Um, and I'm a true believer if it's banned in Europe um, or whatever, like I just believe that they care for their people over there and they only ban products. I won't get into it because I don't want to start like this big debate, but yeah, so I just wasn't using hydroquinone for a long time. And you know what? I feel like my dark spots are just getting darker and I have so much acne scarring, which again, you can't see when I do my tutorials. And you guys all say I have such pretty skin in it. I'm like, ooh, thanks. But really, I don't know how to get it true to what I really look like. And I'm okay with that though, cause whatever, I mean. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna try this. There was good reviews on it. Some people were saying it worked so well. Other people said it didn't work at all. Some people said it burnt their face. So I'm excited to see. One of the packages that got delivered was Kat Von D. Eee! Oops, oh, I really like this packaging. She looks gorgeous, right? Really pretty. Inside is a really nice letter. Really cute. I opened it while my phone was charging because my phone died. So we got the, oh, we got the new Shade and Light Eye Palettes, the little mini ones. There's four of them. I'll open them in a minute. I just have one hand. Shade and Light Eye Contour Brush and Case. These are Color Correcting Eyeshadow Primer. Nice. I like these because then they'll neutralize any darkness on the lid which a lot of us have and it's normal okay let me put I don't want to open anything it's so pretty I'm looking like a little bit of a mess but I don't have anyone to impress that was kind of almost a rhyme I went to the store to the liquor store because I I went there originally because I wanted to get these um, pretzels, these little pretzels that are dipped in uh, like yogurt. I don't know, I was cra craving something sweet and it sounded really good. And then my sister's boyfriend was like, oh, can you give me a, a beer? And then I got sidetracked and I forgot to get pretzels that I wanted. Now, I mean, I guess that's a good thing. I uh, should be watching what I eat anyways. <sighs> Boring. Um, yeah, so now I'm back and I got this beer I don't know if it's good or not. I used to like beer, now I don't really drink that much anymore. Maybe I'll steal one from him, maybe not. Not sure yet. And, uh, oh, you know what? I didn't show you guys the Kat Von D stuff. My phone said it was out of storage, 
and so I got sidetracked. So I'll have to show you the Kat Von D stuff I got and that Fanity because I pulled that out of the box too and I put it up, but I haven't plugged it. I'll show you that too. So this is that Vanity lighting I was talking about earlier. Um, so this right here is a fan that you can turn on and off and then this mirror itself lights up as well. Um, I can't look it out messy don't judge me I can't plug it in right now because it's one of these plugs and my extension cord that I was gonna plug it in it doesn't have one of these to it so I have to reach around and I have to unplug some stuff to make it work but I'll get it to work because this is nice especially because I like I've told you guys when I'm filming videos it gets really hot in my room and this will like cool down but it's also nice for when you do setting sprays and stuff because it will cool you down it's not too strong to wear it's going to blow like your hair or your lashes or make your eyes water or anything like that. So that's, it's really nice. It's such a nice vanity to hand make it all. Um, I mean, look at how pretty, <laughs> look at how pretty it is. Wow. I have all my allergy stuff and I'm a mess. So you get the LED light, two speed fan. I didn't know it was two speeds. That's good to know. So these are the Kat Von D palettes. I um, finally opened them. Let me hide this so it doesn't look as gross. Okay, yeah. Um, palettes are nice because you can, I mean, they're good for travel. They come with a mirror. It's nice because sometimes you don't want to take a whole huge palette with you. I can already tell you right now that I love this one. Love it. Um, and then the color correcting primers. So these are nice because they do have a color to it. So it's an eyeshadow primer that has color to it, which is great because it will neutralize any darkness on the lid. And they gave me um, all the different colors to that. It goes all the way pretty darn deep. That one was the light, I believe, or the fair. That one's light that I just did. And then the brush as well, which is double-ended. Really pretty. I love the packaging. I like brands that pay attention to detail, like packaging. I think that makes or breaks a line. I'm actually just going to take my makeup off and then that's about it. Probably just eat and go to bed. Um, sorry it took me so long to make a new vlog. I'm going to try tomorrow to bust out some videos because I am going to, I might disappear again. So hopefully I can put some videos out that way I don't disappear. Um, I'm going to be working at Coachella this year, which is awesome. Like next week we have rehearsals. I'm gone for the weekend and then I'm gone the following weekend because same thing Coachella is two weekends um, I have been makeup assisting for this amazing artist Tanya she is Sia Sia's makeup artist uh, I don't know if you know who Sia is she's a musician she's an artist and she always wears those big wigs and covers her face but Tanya makes all of like her wigs and so I've been doing makeup for the dancers, which is awesome, and then assisting Tanya. And so they picked me up to do Coachella, which is amazing. And I did um, American Idol last week, I think it was. I did American Idol. I did the makeup for the dancers again. And um, before that, I did makeup for the dancers for some videos that I think is going to be playing at Coachella which is kind of cool because I get to see it all come together. So it's been, I've been busy, a lot of makeup appointments as well, freelancing, makeup for Feral Cosmetics, which is a lipstick company. And I've been posting those on my Instagram and bridal stuff. I did a commercial, stuff like that. So it's been a lot of fun. I've been busy. It looks like someone's like peeking in. I've been busy and I'm sorry that I just disappeared. You know, I can't, I wish I could take and record when I'm doing makeup but I just I can't right now and I'm just been working as a makeup assistant so it's like I'm not gonna step on anyone's toes and be like hey can I film you know no, 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 no. but yeah it's been crazy and I'll definitely um, try to film when I'm at Coachella cuz I think that would be a lot of fun doing makeup behind the scenes we'll see how that goes I can't wait for the day when I'm doing makeup and I get to have my own assistant that is the goal. I will probably film a tutorial next using these little mini palettes. 
and then um, get this vanity all hooked up as well. But I, bet I got a bunch of new stuff too that I still haven't even made a video about, which I feel bad. So maybe I'll do a video like newness because I've had a bunch of stuff, like stuff that I purchased, purchased a lot of stuff that I didn't need, Urban Decay's summer stuff. Thank you for watching my vlog and I hope that my room gets cleaned magically by an elf. I don't know. Okay. Bye guys. Bye.